So a problem that we have with a lot of footballers and sportsmen in particular is after they get a hit on the head, they might get a concussion. And at the moment, we're not really sure about the best way to assess these players, whether they're ready to come back onto the field or not. Some of the tests that we do at the moment will check things like how good your memory is and how well you can calculate and do things like this. Something that we here at Aspatar think that might have been missed is a problem that you have if you have to turn your head and you have to think about players around you at the same time. When you spin your head, if you have concussion, then your balance can become a problem. So the test that we're doing here using the virtual reality headset forces the players to do this in an environment that simulates sport, looking for their teammates on the field, and then they have to make a movement. In this test, we assess how fast they move, how accurately they place their foot, how much time they have to spend scanning their head and how fast their foot is moving. All of this together we think gives us more information than our normal tests do about concussion and it will be a nice complement to the different kinds of concussion tests that we already do here at Aspatar. So our aim is to be able to continue to develop this platform and we've been working with the guys at Resil in Manchester in the United Kingdom to develop a test that we can actually do on the sideline. So when the players are suspected of being concussed, one of the tests we might be able to add is this sideline test to tell whether their balance is good and whether they can put their feet where they need to at the same time as spinning their head around to do the normal movements they have to do in football. Mm -hmm.